energy pulsing through me. Energy pulsing, pulsing through energy, pulsing through me. Hello, this is David Anderson, Networking Online Watchman, coming to you from my basement, otherwise known as the Dave Cave. This is where I spend a lot of my time just kind of hanging out, uh, studying, reading, chatting, drawing, playing my music, whatever I do. And so I just wanted to uh, introduce you and invite you in today and let you know that I want to talk about personal branding. It's what I've been learning about for a while. It's what I've been doing for quite a while, uh, naturally, and I'm learning the benefits of it. And so the question really is, what is personal branding and why should you care? Okay, so, so many of you... Uh, are in business for yourselves or dabbling in business or trying to be a presence online trying to do things to um, broaden your horizons um, add extra income maybe make a name for yourself maybe build a, build a business for yourself but I'll say to you that the, for the long haul if you're just doing this for a quick buck don't worry about it okay do your thing but if you're trying to do something that's gonna last personal branding is the way to go I'm a long-term thinker I'm a big thinker and so personal branding is a great fit for me. So let's talk about it a little bit. So basically, most people will get all excited. They'll, they'll get involved with a, a company or um, an idea, a product, a service, an entity, and they get all excited about, uh, about that thing, okay? And so uh, you wanna go sell that thing, offer this service, um, point to this company, this is great, look what, you know, and all those associations. And so that what you're doing is you're actually selling, promoting, building, edifying somebody else's business. They'll often tell you that you're, um, you know, they'll entice you with the idea of being free and uh, being your own boss, building your own future. But really all they're doing is paying you to be the advertising arm of their business. And so all along you're putting your time, your money, your energy into uh, building the name, building the brand for a company or a product. And again, they're paying you for that. They're paying you to be their advertising, uh, but that's it. Okay, and the money is short term, it's small, small change. And now the problem is when you grow, if you wanna establish yourself as a leader amongst them, typically that gets kiboshed because uh, uh, it really isn't, you don't really have the freedom that you think you have. And, um, but also, Along the way, things happen, things change. You might move, your interests change, money runs out, you get tired, um, the company goes belly up, uh, the product goes bad, you know, you, you know, you have internal relationships that go wrong, whatever. People come and go with these things all the time. And so, let's say you spent three months, six months, a year, two years, three years, investing your time, money, your energy, your blood, sweat, and tears into your business, right, because you're in business for yourself under this company selling this product okay and suddenly you decide to part ways well guess what all your blood sweat and tears is still being uh, is still being receiving the benefit but you're no longer receiving the benefit you no longer have the product to sell you're no, no longer under the company name but they are receiving the benefit all of, the, of the, all the effort because you've established customers you've put a name out there you've built their brand so they're they're like, well, okay, well, see you later. We're doing our thing. And you're like, okay, here I am again, back at square one. So personal branding has to do with um, investing in you, building a name for you, establishing you, selling, promoting you. Not in a selfish way, but in a solid, savvy way. So I want to say to you that people buy ultimately from who they know, like, and trust. We know that. That's a given, right? And so when you, with personal branding, when and if you move on and you decide to do the next business, you're not really starting from scratch because if people are attracted to you, if they're drawn to you and you've done a good job presenting who you are, okay, and, and, uh, and, and your character doesn't change, your interests don't change. By the way, I'm sorry, I've been on a roll here, okay. Uh, Duncan and Paul, and uh, let's see who else we got going on. Okay, that's awesome. Amanda came right on, okay, and, uh, and Letty Ortega. All right, well, great. Thank you for watching, I appreciate the support. I'm new to this whole live thing, but I get on a roll sometimes. But um, so your blood, sweat, and tears goes into all that. Now, in the meantime, you're not starting from square one again because when it comes time for the next thing you sell, if people are drawn to you and they're your fans, your followers, your friends, 
um, they're going to want to say, well, okay, well, that's cool. Hey, no problem. I get that. So what are you doing now? You know, and, and they'll be more or less apt to, um, to roll with you in these changes. But if you've been the XYZ guy or the, or the, uh, you know, the Miss So-and-So girl, and then so uh, you're no longer that person anymore because you're not selling that XYZ thing or working for so-and-so anymore. That's your, that was your identity. Right? And so you're to the point now where um, you're no longer that person, so people don't know what's going on with you. And, and so now you're kind of starting from scratch, reestablishing the trust factor, the like factor, all those things. All right, so personal branding is tied very closely to what many of you may have heard as um, attraction marketing. Right? So attraction marketing is interesting. It's a game changer. It's a whole different philosophy. Um, as opposed to going out and getting the business, traditionally we were told to you know call all of our all of our friends and family, knock on the doors, reach out in your social clubs, your church, and all these things. Basically, go get the business. Um, attraction marketing is such that it's built upon more about um, again how you're presenting yourself. Um, hi, Gladys. All right, and uh, let's see, bring yeah, all right, but. Um, so how you're presenting yourself, and so people are kind of drawn to you, maybe uh, maybe build some curiosity, but basically as long as they feel like they know you and they like you and, and there's a trust factor there, you know, you won't have to go get the business, the business will come to you. It takes longer time, it's more strategic, but it's well worth it in the end. So this is um, tied to personal branding. If you think about any niche, okay, any, um, any area of business or career, uh, the people that are doing the best in those areas are people that have built a name for themselves. All right? So they actually um, they have a following because right? they've branded themselves within their marketplace. Okay? And if you think of any marketplace, there's always a key name or figure who jumps right out. Okay? So because uh, um, they actually don't talk about their products. Those people that are at the top of the game hardly ever talk, uh, adopt the company name or the product name. They're just always talking about value. They, you know, they offer advice. Uh, they're the ones who are just kind of confident, at peace. They don't say a whole lot. They'll talk, show you their lifestyle or they'll show you, um, you know, again, nuggets of wisdom or just kind of things that are sharing with you. Just kind of, they just give and they give and they give. Okay. Yet somehow they have the biggest businesses and the, and the, and the most loyal followings. That's because of branding and attraction marketing. Okay. So I just want to mention this stuff to you. All right. I'm going to keep these uh, lives relatively short and see what's going on in my notes here. All right, and uh, let's see. Well, that's that's pretty much what I want to share with you, is that um, is that your your blood, sweat, and your tears. You know, your hours, your effort, okay, and all these phone calls and all this foot walking and door knocking and all these things that we do to build our business, okay, without branding, without attraction marketing, without investing in you, your persona, so that people um, will see who you are without that honestly you're not in business for yourself you're just an extension of the advertising arm of whatever company you're working for okay and you're only selling for them and selling them branding their name branding who they are you know oh you got to hear the company story you know you should hear about these owners they're so awesome or oh, this company you know uh, they're, they're up and coming or oh, this product is so awesome okay uh, i've been in multiple um multi-level marketing uh, businesses along the way. I'm currently in one now, I'm currently doing well with it, but you don't hear me talking about it, okay? Because my interest is more about where am I going with, uh, uh, where am I in the marketplace and how are people gonna view me? And that stuff will work itself out in time. I'm, I'm fully confident that it will, mark my words that it will. But, um, so I also want you guys to know that I have access to, um, you know, resources that will help you with personal branding uh, the free, it's an endless bottom of pit, bottomless pit, okay, of cutting edge, awesome training that's been helpful to me. I want to offer it to you. And so I'm, um, I'll have a link in the description that basically will take you to an opportunity to access many of these things. And I can also get you uh, specialty training if you reach out to me um, that you want to have, um, you know, say you're struggling with a particular area of how to engage in the social, social media or the marketplace. You know, I can help you with that specifically if you let me know. So, um, what I'm, what I'm proposing to you is that I want to be a networking online watchman. Okay, so I'm here to serve you. I'm on the lookout 
for ways to grow your business, but also to grow your brand, to help you brand yourself. And so that's going to be so critical. Um, another thing about personal branding is if you think about the marketplace, um, you know, on, on any of these multi-level marketing businesses or startup businesses, you're one of tens of thousands of people selling that same widget in the marketplace. Okay, and you and and you might say, well, I have a website. Well, you have a company issue website that they are in control of, and that they uh, and that your personal stuff is very very minimal. Your name is on there. Your maybe a catchphrase or a little a little about section of a sentence or two, but pretty much it's going to be all branding the company, branding the product, branding themselves, and they're asking you to put your stuff out there so they can have access to your circle of friends as they brand themselves through you. What you want to do is you want to have your own website, your own blog, take control of how people view you, okay, and along the way, you know, take your time, your money, your energy, and brand you, and along the way, you've got to have no problem selling that product, selling that thing, because people want to want to know, hey, this is really great what you're doing, I appreciate all the help, I see you're a pretty stand-up person, so what is it that you do again? You know, those things will come, all right, so I just want to share that with you as well. Um, so I think I'll leave it at that for now. There's a lot more we're going to be saying in time. But thank you for, for, for those of you who came along and support me in this, uh, this Facebook Live thing. It's going to be uh, a new adventure. And um, but again, David Anderson, for those of you who don't know me, uh, Networking Online Watchman. And so uh, keep an eye out for things. Uh, here I am signing off. Have a great day. Energy pulsing, pulsing through. Energy pulsing through. Energy pulsing, pulsing through. Energy pulsing. Energy pulsing, pulsing through energy, pulsing through me. Energy pulsing, pulsing through.